let's go for an MRI. Okay, folks, one more final video on magnetism. Well, I've worked out the effects of magnets on fuel uh, is nothing, zero. Now, it even came down to using magnets to age wine. So I stuck it on my cask of wine, if you have a look at the magnets uh, videos, and you'll see, and the effects were nothing. And I drink red wine all the time, so I should know. So, still not satisfied with that. If you have a look at my videos, I actually had a uh, accident a couple of months ago where my leg was crushed and uh, foot was broken and all that sort of stuff. So today, I decided to put myself through the biggest magnetic field that I could imagine. There you go. There's the dates. As you can see, 28th of the 2nd, 2017. MRI, right ankle. Magnetic resonance imaging. It hurt. It actually hurt my foot because it's pretty bad. But, according to these YouTube videos where these professed physics and scientific experts reckon that they change molecules in things and they'll mature your red wine and um, give you better mileage. I should have technically come out of there a little bit more mature, feeling like an 18 year old and maybe even have a bigger appendage. But what happened? Nothing. All I got was pain and some films, slides, whatever you want to call them, of my ankle to take to the doctors. So, I have debunked it completely now. Magnetism does nothing to change molecules, either in your wine, in your fuel, in your water, nothing. So, that's it folks. No more magnetism videos. Debunked. See you later. And don't believe a thing you see about magnets on your fuel lines, your red wines, and all that sort of crap. It's garbage. Don't forget, like and subscribe.